Hello guys, my name is FX and welcome back to The Walking Dead. In the last episode, we saved Glenn's ass and uh, we we didn't save that woman. Uh, we found a woman who got bitten in a motel room uh, and then she decided to take her own life. Um, we got an axe though, so it wasn't entirely uh, a wasteful journey. So now I think we need to use that on the padlock of the store. So without further ado, let's do this thing. Oh, Kikoki. So we've just got back from the motel hotel holiday inn um, and now we need to go back outside. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. Right, so, this time, instead of using the remote control, use the AXO. Expertly done. Awesome. Right, now get the brick and throw it over there. Carefully. I can't reach that brick. All right, uh, use the remote again, and then we can use the brick, right? Those TVs are on. Oh, maybe not. I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. All right, uh, ah! Now, can we pick up the brick? Baby steps, building blocks and all that shit. You need to do A before you can get to B. Pick that up and throw it over yonder. Come on. Best baseball throw. Well done. You had one chance. <laughs> Nicely done. Now, can we send Doug to go and get the pharmacy keys? <laughs> or is it me? Right, alright. Uh, let's go over there. Watch me back, Doug. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Slowly does it. Slowly does it. We're alright. We're in the clay. We're in the clay, mate. Keep going. Keep going. Do it again, mate. Do it again. One more. One more. There you go. All right. Third time's the charm. He's a bloody tough son of a bitch, this guy, isn't he? Five times? Five times? Oh. Why did he just do that in the first place? Oh, my days. Well, at least that's done. Let's get the key and let's get out of here. Right, well now we've got no padlock on the door. Oh, nice one. He's gonna hold it up. <laughs> but we did it. That's all that matters. Right, let's get in that pharmacy and get him the meds he needs. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Oh, shit. oh shit! We gotta hurry. How would you not know about the alarm in your own store? Come on, Lee, you dropped the ball on that one, mate. Ball 
Alex. Now everyone in a mile radius is going to hear that bloody thing. It's worse than a bloody bullet. Shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Have you seen the amount of bastards? And even the one that's crawling wants a bit of meat. Look at her! Bloody hell. Oh, well, her dad's fine now, isn't he? Good for him. Carly's got the gun, right? Oh, right, all right. Uh, Clementine, you stay there. I'm going to help these guys. Oh, shit. Um, can I help you? Anyway, there you go. I did that. I don't know how I did that, but I did it. We don't make it through this. You should know that I think you're a great guy. Shut up, Doc. <laughs> we will make it through this. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should... Oh, come on. Stop it. <laughs> Do that. There you go. I should know what? She pants the pants off this funny gym. Oh, balls! Are you sure? Shoot him then! Hold on. She's quite a good shot, that woman. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real okay? Okay. Right, go and get some of the handles, love. Oh, balls! Did you find anything? Uh, ah, oh, Q, 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 Q. Ah, e. I'm not left-handed. I'm at a disadvantage. Oh, thanks, love. Thanks. I'll take that. Cheers. Put it in there. Put it in there. There you go. Nicely done. Nicely done, sir. Oh, shit. Oh, dog. Dog. Oh, balls. Oh, no. Oh, shit, the bed. Oh, we've got to go with... Oh, I'm going with Carly. I'm sorry, I'm going with Carly. Get the purse, get the purse, get the bullet. There you go. There you go, that's why I saved you. Oh, shit. Oh, no, I'm sorry, dog. Dog, dog. Dude, I'm sorry. Let's go. Shit. He couldn't come two minutes earlier, could he not? Oh, balls! You gotta move. Get off! Quarantine! There we go. Nice one. Well done. Can we get the thing that's stuck in her head? No. Oh, keep running. Run, 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 run. You bastard! I risked my life for you getting those meds and this is how you repay me! Oh, you like, you're gonna get it! You're gonna get it! Should've let him die! Should've let him die, Lee! I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Thanks, mate. Especially a good friend. Nice one! We're good We're best pals is what we are! Bye! Glenn. With uncountable severe emergencies in all counties, Georgia cities and their 
current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage 9 catastrophe. Augusta, stage 8 I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Aw, oh, man! Alright, well... We're a man down! Take it easy, Glenn! I like Glenn. I hope we see him again. I miss him already. He was like a brother to me. Speaking of which, Kenny, my old mate, how are you doing, Thank sir? You. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. You said you wanted kids once. Uh, I did, yeah. Well, she's not your daughter, so you can't treat her like she is. Yeah, I know that. But you can take care of her. Hell. Maybe better than a father even could. Thanks, Kenny. I got your back, pal. I like Kenny. He's a good egg. Can I have that axe so I can go and kill that motherfucker that tried to kill me, please? Have you still got it? Have you? Have you? How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. Okie dokie, you don't have to tell me twice. Wait. Let's go... Oh. What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Are you? Are you? Are you? Oh, I was gonna help I you was both. Gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know. Me too, Carly. All right. Well, that was depressing. Going down memory lane. Let's go and see the kids. Cheer myself up. He's chatting on a fair bit. His duck. You knob! I hate you! I'll be coming to you in a minute with an axe! But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then Hey Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. I was there though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you... You watch your ass. Wow! Hey, Lee, do you have a second? Mm. 
My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Why did the music change? We're lucky to have you. Some shit's about to go down, Lee. Don't trust her. Don't trust her. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Famous last words. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, just cue the blackout, why don't you? Keeps it interesting, doesn't it? To be continued. Fan dabby dozy. Leave on a high. Pfft. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. Fuck with us! Now we're gonna take you on! There's too many of them! guys i am gonna leave that one there so that's episode one done and finished out of five i think i think there's five episodes in season one um episode two looks like we're gonna be introduced to some brand new characters and we uh we're going to a farm apparently yay get me a chicken so thank you so much for watching and i shall see you in the next video take it easy guys bye bye oh nicely done well done get that this is a shame oh -ho! Night night. Oh, I missed that. I missed the opportunity of actually heading, but I did it eventually against the brick wall. Let's get to this oil pump, shall we? Oh, God. how the hell?